I'm um, part of UN Habitat, of the UN Habitat family, but I'm also in the movement of the bike path in Barcelona and all related to how we are like demanding the right of kids to, to ride in a city. The issue in Barcelona is that we have a lot of uh, bike infrastructure, but what we are demanding and what we see when we are riding is that um, there's a lack of safety and especially there's a lack of uh, connectivity between the, the lanes that we are having. So the movement in Barcelona has been really empowered by this idea that uh, when something is uh, safety for kids, for children, it's safety for everyone. So we are uh, very in deep in this idea of the 8 to 80, I mean, and, and we want to put it even to 4 years old to 80 years old, so infrastructure safety for everyone. started like really broadly in Barcelona is the movement of the bike paths and what we do is that every week we are accompanying children to the school by bike but we put the children in the place uh, of the car so it means in the, in the road and with this idea of going by group and going all together Right now we have like around 10 lines of bike paths in Barcelona and in the region, Alonia, we are around, uh, I don't know, more than 20 for sure. You know what I like most? I like when we are with the uh, bike paths riding, the neighbors clapping to us because you understand that the, the entire uh, citizens uh, are happy about this change in the, in the city. Every first Friday of, uh, of each month, what we are doing is like we are protesting in front of the, the schools to demand that we want like safety surroundings for schools. Um, because the main issue that we are having in Barcelona is that most of the schools are located in, in big streets. I mean, streets that are high density of cars. So we put there, we put the kids in the street, uh, we play in the street. And we, and we cut the transit for one hour and a half uh, in the afternoon. Yeah, we got an email saying that we were recognized as one of the best initiatives in the world for the, the World Bicycle Day. So yeah, we are very excited about that. You know, it's, it's something that makes you like to continue working on that. And, uh, and I think that is something that also makes that other cities and other movements can, can also see that this is happening and perhaps they can do it themselves.